Well, of course, there are loads of outlets all over the race course where you can uh, pick up some uh, lunch or afternoon tea. But right at the top of the list, my favourite would be here. This is the Parade Ring restaurant. It is, of course, fine dining. You can see plenty of early guests have come here, enjoying a glass of champagne before sitting down for a three-course meal. There's a lovely ambience in here. And as its name suggests, there's a wonderful view of the Parade Ring, which we'll have a look at in just a moment. But... Uh, Everyone enjoying their lunches so far, but this is the, the, the great view of the parade ring. You can um, come out and enjoy uh, the view from the terrace and have a look down at some of the runners and, of course, watch the racing on the television. But uh, as this is right at the top of the list, designing the menu is none other than Raymond Blanc, who's um, been integral to Ascot over a number of years. He works here during the Royal Meeting, and it's uh, great that he's uh, going to be joining me, hopefully. I know he's down in the kitchen at the moment, just um, doing some fine tuning for some dishes, but we have an array of dishes. Just have a look at these. We're going to have a little sample. Um, we've got, of course, fish dish, smoked salmon, it looks like a mushroom risotto. Uh, pork belly and a load of uh, puddings so I'm hoping Raymond's going to come out and um, out of the kitchen and come and talk to me he's on his way now he's a very very busy man understandably um, so it's great that he's found some time to come and have a quick chat with me I can see he's on his way I think he's also been uh, chatting away to some of the guests who started to enjoy their lunches but uh, we've got a whole array of uh, dishes to talk to Raymond come over and have a quick chat as he's just uh, instructing some of his, uh, his, his staff. Raymond, lovely to see you here at Ascot. Now we've got a whole array of dishes, but first, um, you enjoy coming here to Ascot, whether it's the Royal Meeting, whether it's a sort of um, a Saturday in September or here at Champions Absolutely. Day. Absolutely. Any weather, whether it is rain, wind or sun, <laughs> it's always a British Championship day. It's extraordinary day. It's going to be fun. We have prepared some extraordinary food here, and I would love to briefly talk about it. Because Go on, really, it's a, it's a beautiful sea bream. With rhubarb? Yes. With, no, no, not rhubarb. Voilà. With a, um, a beautiful seeds, okay, uh, um, <coughs> Bulga weeds, fennel, and, and chards. There you got a, so simple and so delicious, so fresh. The girls will love it because no guilt. No guilt here either. It's that one looks beautiful. With lots of joy and no guilt whatsoever. <laughs> we like that, you know? Is it quite hard to design for today, going the weather is a little bit sort of, you but never yes, quite up and down? But, but I think, having said that, there's always some beautiful seasonal produce. It's the end of the summer, the beginning of the autumn, and we've got the first truffle, the first wild mushroom. Oh, look at this beautiful truffle. truffle. Oh, 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 mon Dieu. You must, you must have one. <laughs> Wow, uh, strong tasting. Okay, there you have a Jacob ladder, which is just in between his ribs here. A wonderful mix of uh, beautiful meat, a little bit of uh, fat, delicious, make melting. And there, a little gastrit. Look at that, beautiful. So a little pure potatoes, the first steps, wild mushrooms here. And then we have, uh, oh, let's go for there. There's Change the order. Yeah. So I've got a lovely horseradish sorbet, which goes onto my terrine of beetroot. Okay, all from the Manoir Garden, Belmont Le Manoir Quatre Saison Garden. So all is fresh, all is clean. A little tain of a, of a pork with a gribby sauce and, and a sourdough toast. And then, of course, for the girls. <laughs> for the girls. The pudding. A spoon of some sort. <laughs> Thank you very much. Voilà. Voilà. Très bien. And then you. Hop. The little marshmallows. Look at that. How beautiful these colors are. The end of the summer. Those are, by the way, Scottish raspberries. Okay, they're called Glendol variety. They are the sweetest. They are the most beautiful. And Attention to detail. Well, yes, it's all about that. It's all about best produce. It's all about a great team as well. And Ascot team has been brilliant. You probably know that I've been involved with Ascot as a academy, the Ascot Academy, teaching and training young people. So Ascot becomes a prime venue and that it is actually more fun dining rather than event food. That's what we're aiming at. And it's amazing to see this is these kids that we have trained, okay, with the Ascot team, with Andrew, with, with uh, 
you know, Abby and uh, Jessica and all these wonderful people. We work, we have a great team, and I think we are going to deliver today a great day to our guests. You have, no you have designed uh, menus at all sorts of restaurants around Ascot, but being here in the Parade Ring restaurant, this is top of the list? That's it. That's a place to be. Okay. Uh, so I feel I've been promoted because uh, <laughs> before I had another restaurant in Ascot, Cape Panoramic, which was also brilliant, but here you have much more better kitchen first, so you can create even better food. And uh, it's been a joy really to see that young team develop so well. And what is also good, we have 50% of retention of our team. It's enormous. In any event business, if you have 10%, you've done well. So the training starts to pay off. We keep our young people with us. Sounds brilliant. Right, I think I'm going to stay here. I know you're a very busy man, Raymond. Thank you so much for talking us through the, the menu, and I know you've got lots of guests to entertain. I think I might stay here, Mike, and um, perhaps sample some of this food a little bit closer. <laughs> Thank Why you very now? much. Why not now? For good oh, wash down with... <laughs> Absolutely.